Over 250 students from 30 universities have enrolled for the cybersecurity training from which they'll compete and eight of them will be chosen to undergo UCC training in cybersecurity. The successful students will join the rest of the world to help Uganda face the challenges of technology since it's attached to almost everything in everyday life. Knowledge, passion, the, the level at which is somebody is, the, the leadership, all those different aspects of the individual will be looked at. Uh, we have a process in, through which we are going to, to pass. This process will end up where we shall have selected about eight who will be trained in depth. But of course, uh, as we go along, we shall train trainers of trainers, we will bring influence. Due to high demand in the cybersecurity space, the trainees will have advantages of acquiring jobs and also being job creators, among others. So they can use different avenues to explore more. So really this is just a drop in the ocean, but hopefully one of the big drops that will push them further, both those who will win and those who will not win. So certification is one of our, it's a very critical aspect when it comes to cybersecurity because it's what tells uh, gives confidence to those people who may want to give you a job or to engage you to know that actually you have a certain skill from which they can develop you further. There's already a requirement for these resources in the market. Yeah, and not just for financial institutions, but for other institutions, uh, that's government and non-profit. Yeah, um, they all require information security managers. So enough demand to actually absorb the supply. Thembo says a more than 15 billion is lost every year on cybersecurity, and the trainees shall not only be aware of the dangers that come along with cybersecurity, but also handle them. Companies you lose a lot, closer sums of resources, time uh, into the, these compromise in the cybersecurity. This is going to develop their skills in different domains, such as vulnerability assessment, penetration testing, digital forensics, and computer network defense. Shaida Tinasaku, UBC News.